New for this school year, the American Academy of Pediatrics is calling for all children to be screened for potential heart issues, and that's regardless of their athletic status. News for Jack's reporter Brianna Andrews is joining us live. Brianna, you spoke with a local doctor about how certain screenings could save lives. I did and I learned a, a really alarming statistic. So listen to this every year. Thousands younger than 25 suffer from some type of sudden cardiac issue. Now that's according to the American Academy of Pediatrics. Now doctors say to prevent this, they recommend EKG screening at early ages. Taking your child to get an EKG is an unexpected new item on the back to school checklist. Pediatricians recommend parents to mark off immediately. In the United States, there are about, uh, you know, about um, 2,000 individuals under the age of 25 that have a cardiac arrest every year. Uh, because these are young people, uh, they've had no underlying cardiac defect in the past. Cardiac issues in children can be more common than what you think. Dr. Uh, Sarita uh, Fern, a pediatric cardiologist at Wolfson Children's Hospital, patients. is witnessing an uptick in patients with heart issues. It is possible that with COVID in the last 18 months and us seeing so many uh, patients with uh, rhythm problems and cardiac involvement after COVID, that there has been a sudden push and it's just taken it over the brink where it's now a recommendation. The American Academy of Pediatrics urges all children to be screened for conditions that can lead to cardiac arrest or death, regardless of athletic status. Uh, it's a simple and effective screening tool in the right hands because if an ECG is read by the right person, uh, namely a pediatric cardiologist, you know, uh, proficient in reading EKGs, then it can screen out some of the uh, life-threatening conditions that one might not know about in pediatric patients until they have a cardiac arrest. Florida lawmakers considered a plan earlier this year that would have required EKGs for student athletes. It was removed from a bill that now requires some students to learn CPR. The EKG requirement will get another look this fall in Tallahassee. And we know cost is a concern for parents. EKGs can be a little pricey, ranging anywhere from hundreds of dollars, depending on your insurance. But there are some Florida school districts that are giving it to kids for as low as $20. Reporting live from Nassau County, Brianna Andrews, Channel 4, The Local Station.